This is a Singer 31K32, an early industrial straight stitch sewing machine, used mainly by tailors for clothes like suits and skirts. This particular machine is different from some other 31 models. Note the clutch on the rear which enables you to wind the bobbin without the needle moving. Of course you can still wind the bobbin when sewing. Simply flip this unit to the balance wheel. The other thing that's different to a 3115 model is the ability to backtrack with this lever. It operates like the domestic machines. The further down is the larger the stitch length. Up is the reverse. The stitch length lock screw limits or widens the range of the stitch length and back tack. On this tailor's machine I will run this upholstery leather. It's thick. It can stretch. One layer is no problem at all. The second is harder and with the third it's really struggling. Not strange considering the type of material. Four layers of non-elastic leather is not a problem though. The Stinger 31 is a fairly large industrial sewing machine. It measures roughly 47 by 18 centimeters, that's 18 and a half by 7 inches. It's substantially heavier than the domestic sewing machine. One of the advantages of an early model sewing machine is it has no oil pump. So when you sew at a low speed there's no fuss whether or not the oil gets pumped to all the components. You, as the operator, will have to maintain it. The Singer Manufacturing Company was thoughtful enough to help you remember. Manuals for the 31K32 are hard to find. It uses a non-flattened round industrial size needle. Singer mentions the size as a 16 by 87 in the manuals. My original 1925 Singer sewing machine works fine with a 16 by 230, also known as a DBX F2, 287WH, 1738 and 16 by 257. Others use the 135x5 type needles, also known as the type 134, SY1955 and DPX5. Note the maximum size is a size 23 needle. Before you thread the machine I would like to point out that the hole in the needle points sideways, left to right or right to left, whatever you prefer. The groove should be on the left side of the needle. How to thread this singer? Take the thread from the spool and stick it through the left spool pin on top of the machine, right to left. Then to the element with the three holes, through the top hole right to left and also the bottom one also right to left. Then under this tension unit and let the spring catch the thread. Under this hook To the swing arm, thread goes from right to left, to the first and second hook, down just above the needle through this hole and thread the needle from A left to right. The mechanism is similar to the Domestic Singer 15 model range. It operates with an oscillating hook. The hook of the race catches the loop underneath your fabric and pulls it all around the enclosed bobbin. It uses a similar bobbin. The part number is 2996 for Singer 16 and 31 models. These bobbins are regular available as most other parts and accessories. That is one of the strengths of the Singer brand. Nearly all parts can be ordered. Just visit AliExpress, Amazon, eBay or the specialized vendors. Well, that's it. Uh, stop watching this lame video and start creating.